Hello, everyone. Today, my guest is Sharon Brown, and we will be talking about the Galactic Guides and the Light Code Language. I'm personally familiar with the terms, but I don't know details what is behind those names. And because Sharon will be one of the speakers at Magical Creators Live event, and she will be taking us through a session which is called Reinvent Yourself. And it will be involving the galactic guides, the light code language. And I thought it would be great for us all to know what to expect. But before we start unpacking those terms, Sharon, can you introduce yourself and tell us a little bit about what you do? Hi, Inga. My name is Sharon Brown, and I run my company called Living Uniquely You with Sharon Brown. And what I do is I channel light codes that come in and on a different frequency um, and it clears energetic blocks, earthly constrictions or whatever it's holding you blocks in your life so you can move forward. Light language and is heart coherence. And the logic mind doesn't actually understand light codes. And what happens is it's felt, it's seen, or it's heard. So a lot of the body, the body can feel it. So you'll feel the vibration through the body. You might actually see a code, which can be any sort of code. And then um, it's all around the heart, which is the higher heart, which is what the soul needs to hear. So what happens is we ask the logic mind to step aside so we can receive what we need to receive at that moment in time. So each code has a very, very different frequency. Um, I don't actually just channel one light language because I say light codes because my light language, it's like I send up a beam of frequency. I send up my light up to the highest realms, the galactics. And it's like I'm fine tuning a radio station. So my frequency and I will pick up whatever tone or language or code that needs to come down and that will come out. And then I just have my full trust in my guides that whatever comes out of my mouth is actually what you need at that moment in time. So I literally step, I literally allow my logic mind and my logic step side to fully step out and literally just channel the whole pure soul. Our galactic guides, we all have a galactic guides. We all come from the galactics at, at some sort of life form. We can be um, Syrian, we can be an Atlantic, we can be an Octurian, a Lemurian. It's whatever. There's so many different types of galactics out there but we can also have many different forms the same way as we've had many past lives here. On this, wor this world, on Earth, we have had many past lives up in the galaxies. So what it, what's really happening is we are remembering because that stuff is, is within our DNA, it's in our cellular memory because we've come in with that. So what we are really doing is remembering that old wisdom, remembering what we have been taught and learned before. So we're bringing through that wisdom for us here on this earth. And then it's helping us through all this trying times that we are going through at, the, at this moment in time, because we all find it hard. So that's where the light codes and the tones come in. When you were talking about remembering yourself, is it resonated with me a lot. And it feels like I was called to invite you in order to remember myself. So um, for those of you who don't know, every time when I put together an event, I intuitively tune in asking mm -hmm. what kind of speakers need to take part this year. And Sharon was a strong candidate putting forward by my guides that absolutely necessary to be um, at the event. 
Mm. And now I can feel why uh, I understand, even at logical level, I understand. Speaking yes. about the logical level, let's say people who may never come across light codes, light language, I've heard you um, mm. channeling light language. It, it feels absolutely you can't understand a word. No, it's so, probably gook. <laughs> yeah, so <laughs> it even if somebody doesn't understand or maybe even don't believe that it can bring any difference, would it still work for those people? Yes, it does, because what it does is it bypasses the logic, it bypasses the ego and goes right into the body where it needs to go. So it's literally what it's doing is it's it's freeing the soul because it's, it's really language for our soul that we're bring, that I bring in because what it does is because of the earthly constrictions and everything else, we, we all come in with a soul contract. But we do forget from birth because we're all conditioned to a certain way and you must perform this and you must perform that. And we all must think inside this lovely square box. But us as intuitives don't think inside that box, but we can get caught up in the everyday bullshit that's out there and that's where the light language and the light codes literally free the soul to help you move forward and that's what that's what it is so it literally whether you understand it you believe it or you trust it you are still going to get the same amount of benefit as I you or the next person is going to get because it's always no matter what code I bring in it's that everyone has a very very different experience excellent and just briefly uh, if you can sum up what awaits us at your session on uh, 5th and 6th of October yeah so what's going to what I'm going to do is I'm going to clear all the stuff that we are holding on to in our DNA, down to our cellular memory to clear all that we need to do to revent ourselves. And what I will do is then bring, call in our highest potential and I will activate that with the light codes or the tones or whatever I received that day. So it's really allowing the soul to be free and it's allowing ourselves to reinvent ourselves and step forward to our next level of consciousness that is always there awaiting us. But sometimes, like that, through the blocks and stuff, we just can't see it. Beautiful. I can't wait myself. Sometimes it seems that I create this event for my own benefits, <laughs> for my personal evolution. Mm -hmm. So for those of you who haven't got the ticket yet, uh, check the link below. It's magicalcreators.live. And you are welcome to read through the agenda. This year we have... Um, two days online and then one day in person if you wish to attend in person on 17th of October. Um, those events, they are independent. Each day is independent. And no matter which session you attend, you will get this divine development, divine transformation that you meant to have. Thank you very much, Inga, for having me on. Thank you. Thank you.